going on YouTube? Welcome back to Sick Pulls and today on the channel we have another subscription box. This one is the Big Bat Box. Now I haven't had these in a while. Um, I believe the owner got sick and wasn't able to send them out. So hopefully he's doing better and they're starting to get these back out. Um, so I actually did just rip my February box off camera because I had both of them already and we were already in April, so I didn't want to do the February one, and I had a lot of stuff to open. So this is actually the March one, and I believe my April one just got sent out. So I should have that on the channel very soon. Now, this was $40 shipped. Um, they do they did just increase prices on both of their boxes for April. So instead of $40 now, they're going to be $50 due to the increasing in prices. Still, in my opinion, great pricing on these boxes. They're some of the cheapest that you can find around with some great packs even including some hobby packs in this box. Um, I know it's been a slow week for me. This I did the two subscription boxes, including this one, and then the mail day, which is pretty awesome in my opinion. Um, but, you know, not, nothing really came out this week, and I do have Prism and Select Retail that I'm going to eventually be getting into either next week or the week after. Um, there is a lot of new hobby releases next week as well, which I'll be getting into, which will be a lot of fun. Um, and... Yeah, I mean, I can see right here, like, we have a Diamond Kings pack. That comes out on Wednesday. I actually did pick up one of the first off-the-line boxes, so I'll have that as well. Um, Bowman comes out next week. Um, UFC Prison comes out next week, which is probably too overpriced for me. But I definitely will have Bowman and Diamond Kings if you're into baseball. And if you're into other sports, I will have Panini Chronicles football along with most likely Crown Royale basketball. And I really love Crown Royale and doesn't seem it's going to be too overpriced. So I'm definitely going to try and pick that up. But without further ado, let's just get into the packs today. We got Topps Fire. That's a hobby pack. A hobby pack of pro debut. 1991 Stadium Club Series 2. Topps Heritage Minor League. Topps Heritage 2021. That's a hobby pack. And 2017 Diamond Kings. So let's go ahead and start with the 2017 Diamond Kings. Going to get into it right here. Move these off to the side. And we got Frankie Lindor of the Cleveland Indians, now of the New York Mets. Tony Lazari. No way. It's flipped upside down. It's Diamond Kings, though. Can it be an auto? Probably not. I feel like it would say certified auto on the back. Just kidding. It is a uh, gray frame card, though. That's pretty cool. That's a nice little Mike Trout SP. Not the auto, but still a gray framed. And we'll see a couple of those in the hobby pack, uh, hobby box coming up this week. This Miguel Cabrera Aurora insert is really sweet. Love the colors on that. And Don Larson. All right, let's. right, we're going to open the 1991 Stadium Club. I don't always open these because I'm not too much of a vintage collector. But I still like the old baseball cards, so let's go ahead and open them. Sometimes I give them to other people. Maybe these will get thrown in the care package. We'll see. But... These are like super bricked too. Yeah, that good sound that you love to hear. Love this design too, 91 Stadium Club. Sean Bosky is the first card, followed by John Orden, followed by Jeff Montgomery. We got Mike Boddicker. Beautiful Stadium Club membership card there. Jack Morris. Ed Sprague, Steve Olin, man, that sound hurts really bad, Chris James, Steve Ho, Luis Aquino, man, they flip every single car too, Carl Nicholas, and Daryl Strawberry, not bad, like, like a nice little Daryl Strawberry when he's on the Dodgers right there. Pretty cool stuff. Pretty cool stuff. All right. Um, next pack. Not the greatest pack lineup this month, to be totally honest. No Series 1. Um, nothing, like, incredibly new besides the 2021 Heritage, which is nice. But decent box this month. Nothing crazy. But just a fun rip. And 50 bucks. you know, or it's 40 this month. 50 bucks though, going in the future. Um, you know, it's pretty cheap. So, You'll see those boom boxes have much better packs, but you also got to drop at least 150 on them. Um, unless you get the high end, but then the high end is similar to this, which I think even those are around the 100 now. Uh, Balazovic, Jameson, Alex Spees, and Chase Strumpf. So nothing crazy out of pro debut. All right. Um, we got Heritage Minor League 2019. 
Let's see who comes out of this. I believe it is a hobby pack. Yep, hobby. All right. Got Yuzniel Diaz. Isaac Gilliam. Hey, nice Cabrian Hayes. Take that. Good prospect right there. Now a rookie. And there we go. We hit an auto. Had to do a quick double take there. So it's like, is that an auto? Yeah, right across his chest. Tristan Pompey, auto. Let's see. Not too familiar with him. He's from Canada. Believe that he's in the Marlins organization, which is what the Jupiter Hammerheads are. So that's cool. Tristan Pompey. Don't know too much about him, but I'll take any auto of any prospect because you just simply never know. Vidal Bruhan, Gabriel Cancel, William Contreras, and Jemai Jones. So some nice prospect base cards in there, along with the auto. So we have an auto streak now going in the big bat boxes as well. Hobby pack of Tops Fire. Let's see if we can pull an auto out of this as well. That'd be nuts. It'd be nice. We did pull two autos out of our Platinum Boom Box, so maybe we could get a two auto streak going here. Got Jake Lamb, Austin Hedges, a nice fired up of Justin Verlander, Max Muncy, Ronald Acuna Jr., who was on fire before getting hurt, and George Springer. All right. And probably the best pack of the day is Heritage, which is probably not a good thing that it's the best pack of the day. But, you know, you never know if you get the auto. It doesn't look like we have one or a patch. So maybe we hit a nice rookie or a short print here. Avaldi, Toro, Howie Kendrick, Adam Wainwright, Luis Garcia, rookie, Alberto, Corey Seager, Albert Abreu, Miguel Yehuri, and Nick Nelson, and Mookie Betts. And let's just take a quick look to see if there's any variations there. No variations. That's okay. It was fun. Let me know what you guys thought of the mid back box. Nice quick rip sub box here. Like I said, guys, it wasn't the biggest week for me on the channel, but I will have more on the channel next week with a lot of new releases. And I did forget to also pull this out of the box right here. We did get a Roger Clemens Yankees, um, like, sweet stitches patch. So that's pretty cool. Out of $5.99, Roger Clemens. Who knows if he'll get into the haul. But anyway, guys, that was my big bat box. Like I said, I'll have Diamond Kings, Bowman, and Panini Chronicles on the channel next week for all the new releases. I will have Select Football and Prison Football. And then the following week after that, Crown Royal comes out, which I most will likely have. And a lot of the other new baseball releases coming out. There's a ton. We are getting into release season where they're going to start pounding out these releases. Stay tuned. I'm going to have a lot of them. Hope you guys enjoyed the content today. Please like, comment, and subscribe if you did. And I will catch you guys on my next video, which is tomorrow, which is Pokemon Saturday. And if you don't like that, I'll be back next week with more sports cards videos as always. I'm Sig Pulls. Later.